Hello everyone, my name is Christian and today I'm going to show you how to use the Umbraco launch package. The first thing you need to do is create an application on the latch service, which I already did. So now I already have the package installed on my Braco installation. And as you can see, I've got a new section called Launch. If I go there, the first thing I need to do is go to Settings, Application, and in the Latch website, I can find the information I need, which is the application ID and the secret. Click on the save button and that's it. Now we have to pair our application. So we need we go to the settings pairing option and on the mobile phone I have to tap on add new service, pair with large, generate new code. So I have to enter this code here. Keep in mind that it is case sensitive. Uh, now click on the pair button. It thinks for a little while and that's it. We get a notification on the mobile app saying that it is successfully paired and we can start latching our back office. So when you pay your account, you get an uh, operation by default called login O. If I update the latch application and I tap on the on my application I see that there is an operation called login all so I'm going to close it I will log out from the back office and it's still closing it all right so now it's closed and I will try to log in again and I can't and I got a notification on the mobile app saying that someone is trying to access to the back office. So I will um, open it again. And this operation affects all the users. So any user that tries to enter to the back office can't do it while the latch is closed. So now it's open again and I can log it without any problem. So let's create a new operation to see another example. Call it delete code garden. The type is content, the action is delete. So this operation, I don't want it to be applied to all users. So I will choose the foo user and I need to apply to a specific node, which is the code garden node. Click on the save button and on the mobile app, I have to refresh it to get the new operation. So if I tap here, I see that now I have the login all operation and the delete code garden operation. So let's close the delete code garden operation and open a new session with the full user. And it is still closing. Okay, so now it's closed and I will try to delete the code guard note. Okay, and as you can see, I get a uh, error message saying that the delete action is locked on this node. And I also got a notification on my mobile app saying that someone is trying to delete the node. So this is the demo I wanted to show. You can create more operation and uh, different settings. In the video description, I will put links to useful information so you can't uh, learn more about this package. I hope you guys find this useful.